Okay, the posted problem reads, Rework problem 23 from section 2.2 of your text involving the election of officers on a committee. Assume that the committee consists of 11 members, including Julie. The same three offices, chairperson, secretary, and treasurer, are to be filled. Part 1 asks how many ways, how many of these ways is Julie the chairperson? So, each officer position gets its own slot, and in this case, there are three. If we want to know how many ways Julie is the chairperson, we simply assign Julie as the chairperson in the chairperson slot, represented by the C down here. So we'll just go ahead and put a 1 there for Julie, because she's only one person. For the next slot, we look at how many people we have left out of the 11 members, and since we already used Julie, there are 10 left. And then now we only have 9 left. And you simply multiply across, and that gives you 90. And that's the number of ways to select Julie as the chairperson. Moving on to part 2, well, we know there are three officer positions, chairperson, secretary, and treasurer. For this part, we do the same thing we did in part 1, only we do it for every officer position. So we'll go ahead and redo part 1, select Julie as the chairperson, and then 10, then 9. Gives you 90. And for the next two, well, she's already been chairperson, so we'll make her secretary for this one. And then we'll make her treasurer for the final one. So then you can just go through and plug in the remaining members with the other slots. So again, Julie's already been taken away out of the 11, so there's 10, and then 9, and then 10, and then 9. Multiply across, you get 90 for each one and then add them all together and that's going to give you 270 which is the number of ways to select Julie as an officer or the number of ways you can form a committee of three members out of 11 with Julie as an officer okay if you know what you're doing you might realize it's it was kind of pointless of me to create slots for each different arrangement what you could have done is looked at the answer you got for part one which was 90, and then realize, well, there are two officer positions left, and you know that the value of the slots aren't going to change. Only the roles people are assigned to are going to change, which means the product will be the same for each one. So you could have just multiplied 90 times 3 and got the solution, which is 270. And again, there is another way to work this problem, so I'll just go ahead and show you that real quick. Let me switch screens. Okay, here we go. Alternate method. What you could have done is you could have calculated the number of ways to form a committee of three officers from 11 members, and then calculated the number of ways to form a committee of three out of 11, excluding Julie, which really means you're forming a committee of three out of 10 because you're simply removing Julie from the set of 11 members, leaving you with 10. Then you could take the number of ways to form a committee of three from 10 and subtract it from the number of ways to form a committee of three from 11 and the remaining number would have to be all the number of ways to form a committee with Julie as an officer. So let's go ahead and work through that real quick. So for the first part, we're getting the number of ways to form a committee of 3 out of 11. So obviously if you have 11 members to pick from, that's 11 for the first slot. Then you have 10, then you have 9, and multiply those together and you get 990. So for the second part, we're finding the number of ways to form a committee of 3 out of 11, excluding Julie. So like I said, you just subtract Julie from the 11 members, and that leaves you with 10. So then you got 10 to pick from, then 9, then 8. Multiply those together, and you get 720. And then you simply subtract 720 from 990, and that will give you 270. That makes sense because if you know all the ways to form a committee of three from 11 and all the ways to form a committee of three from 11, excluding Julie, and you subtract, then all you'll be left with is the number of ways to form a committee of three, including Julie. Thanks for watching, and again, I'll remind you that you can post your own web work problems on the discussion boards located at facebook.com slash finitehelp.